Okay. Oh, oh we got a spin. Chat. I think we're going to end up seeing an answer here really soon. Oh, look, both greens, both of them. Both of them are coming no. in. Let's see who's oh. going to go. Oh, Victor. Victor. 17.46, that is not correct. Oh. Okay, let's see if Ivan's got correct. it. Ivan comes in seven. Yeah, that is not oh, correct. No. It's got to be in KG. We're looking for KG. Hey, what's up, everybody? Too Tall Toby here, and happy Monday, January 15th. I can't believe we're already so deep into January because what this means is that we've only got one week remaining for you to qualify for free for the upcoming CAD vs. CAD tournament. Too Tall Toby's Spring Open 2024 will be a 16-person tournament, and if you want to participate, you can go over to TooTallToby.com slash spring perform that leaderboard challenge, and we're gonna take the top 16 runners from that leaderboard, or at least the top 16 who can attend, and we're gonna seat them in this tournament. So even if you're not in the top 16, who knows, maybe some of the higher people won't be able to attend and you're still gonna be selected. So be sure to go over to twotalltoby.com slash spring. You can register and qualify for free for the upcoming CAD vs. CAD tournament. Now today, I've got a really epic video for you from the 2023 World Championship Finals. This match features Ivan the Reasonable vs. Victor K, two very experienced runners, very evenly matched, and this one has a surprise ending. So I'll just let the video speak for itself. Let me know down in the comments what you think about this matchup and what you think about these tournaments. And uh, of course, be sure to like, be sure to subscribe, and be sure to come back for some more videos. Enjoy the show. Cad battle. So let's get it. Let's get it. This is going to be the first cat battle of our finals. Who's going to be the world champion of 3D CAD speed modeling? Here we go, guys. Let's make some noise here. Let's get these guys pumped. Here we go. This is it, baby. Our first matchup between these titans for the CAD vs. CAD 2023 championship begins in three, two, one, go! What is the mass of this part in XX.XX? Kilograms, we got another kilogram part. This is MMGS in plain carbon steel. Cool. Really, I should say MMKGS, I guess. Yeah. I like that. Kilograms, what's so, it gonna be? Yeah, oh wow. Kilograms, Alex says 440 hertz. Great answer, <laughs> great answer. Victor oh, K says isn't. LFG and LGRFBS says Canada. All right. Okay. okay. Love Confidence. it. Confidence. All right. Let's take a look at how our champions are going to approach this challenge. So it looks like one of the first things they're going to look for here is symmetry. Is the model symmetric? Is it symmetric in one direction? Is it symmetric in two directions? So they're going to try to use that to their advantage. What do you think, Chris Smith? I see you're holding the print. Is this model symmetric in two directions? It is. Okay, confirm symmetric in yes. two directions. <laughs> and it, it seems that uh, Victor has recognized that as well. And, and Ivan, I, ba based on the way they're both modeling it. So we see that both of our runners are kind of centering their origin. That's going to set them up nicely to do some mirroring later on in this challenge. I think that's a solid strategy. I think you'll see this is going to be one of those speed, speed uh, models. Uh, because Yeah, this is an yeah, easy one. Fairly, fairly straightforward, but speed's a uh, king here. Yeah, I mean, this is definitely going to come down to fundamentals. It's going to come down to how are they utilizing tools like create a line, create a tangent arc, create another line. We saw Victor just deploy that no problem, creating that corner shape there. We see Ivan is uh, leveraging the use of centering the geometry. You see he's uh, getting in here, doing some dimensioning. They're both really fast with their S key. I mean, this is a model that, you know, we built it when we were auditing it. And I think it took us maybe 20, 30 minutes to build. Let's see how long mm -hmm. it takes these guys. I'm sure Brad in the crowd is running the clock. We're gonna find out how long it's gonna take these guys. Wow, wow, wow. Love seeing these guys take different approaches, makes it harder to see who's ahead. That's a great point, says Aaron C in the chat. Very, very good point. Yeah, Al AMO Alex, 440 hertz, uh, yep. musician, I assume. I guess, yeah, that's yeah. what standard A. Yeah. So, let's go. Interesting to see what uh, Ivan's doing. Yeah. I think, I think Ivan's trying to like intimidate Victor right now. Oh, wow! <laughs> Head games, huh? Yeah. It's a, uh, it's mm. interesting. They both, they, they did like kind of start similarly with regards to starting on the origin. But Ivan included that tab yeah. in his first sketch, included that fillet in his first sketch. And now look how quickly Ivan was able to make that tombstone shape. Mm -hmm. Just kind of come up, create a line, arc line, 
really, really fast there from Ivan. Victor K on the right, creating that extra tab that's sticking out, but Victor K's already got that hole in the center with the slot going through it. You know, Ivan's modeling like a man who uh, was just robbed of the championship last year. You know? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, deep cuts. <laughs> well, hey, hey, oh, it's okay I when see you come back now. and win. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, and Kian in the chat says worthy finalists. Very nice. Between CAD classes, Chadwick is here. What a battle oh, indeed. Nice. Welcome, welcome. Nico Concarni says, oh, what quadrant does everyone like to model in? Yes. Mm. Agree. But what, they're, look, they're pretty much in the same spot right now in the model. <laughs> yeah, but I think you know what like uh, up I'm in if I'm if it's not symmetrical, like if I'm not modeling it all centered. Then I'm up and to the right. Okay, yeah, right. okay. I like that. Okay. I go left. Kind of like Victor. Victor went up and yep. to the right. I, I go left myself. You go left? Yep, I'll lefty. All right. Yep. Wow, look at how close these yeah, guys are. Yeah, this is like they're dead on. They are, yeah, they really are neck and neck here. Ivan's now creating that slot, uh, trying to make sure he's got the dimensions correct for that slot, because that's going to matter with the yeah. mass on this one. You know, the mass is going to be tight. What are we, plus or minus? Plus or minus 0 0.01 kilograms. Ooh, okay. That's not very uh, yeah. tolerant. That's uh, uh, 10, 10 grams. Am I doing the math correctly? Intolerant, yeah. Very intolerant. Yeah, the tight. Distant, uh, difference of 10 grams? Yeah, 10 so grams. Point zero one kilograms? Across whatever the, the ultimate mass yeah. ends up being. You should, wow. Uh, wow, wow, wow. Yeah, I'd say you should hear Chris Smith's opinion of the metric system. Okay. Yeah, he's we got can talk about that a little yeah. He's got some ideas. <laughs> so I like Victor K going through, creating that hole using a, what's probably going to be a cut revolve. So mm -hmm. he creates the cross section of that hole. Is it, this is one of these parts, again, where it gives you the distance of, you know, how much meat needs to be on that part between the bottom of the hole and that side wall. Yeah, I've noticed in your models, you like the uh, offset from surface or some sort of offset from some reference. So that's, I think these guys have figured that out. Mix too. it up a little bit here <laughs> as we get into the finals. Yeah. So you said, the, sure. did you say Brad brought his computer and he's out there modeling right now? Uh, Brad, in the yeah, Brad uh, S has his computer. He's out there modeling and Brad K has a stopwatch. So he's keeping track. Of oh, nice. That's, that's cool. Yeah. Yeah. I can't wait for these to be mainly in person. It's yeah. Be so great. Yep. Maybe it's solid box world this year. <laughs> oh. <Ooh. laughs> Okay. Let's <laughs> just chopping it out there for everybody. Some... Solidboxworld.com. <laughs> oh, I didn't get the URL yet. <laughs> someone's gonna oh. someone's gonna be sitting on it. <laughs> That's that. <laughs> oh. Wow. Oh, oh, look at Okay. Oh, oh. we got a spin. This chat. I think oh. we're gonna end up seeing an answer here really soon. Oh, look, both greens, both of them. Both of them are no. coming in. Let's it's, see it's, who's going to oh, go. Oh, Victor. Victor. 17.46. That is not correct. Oh. Okay, let's see if Ivan's got correct. it. Ivan comes in seven. Yeah, that is not oh, correct. No. It's got to be in KG. We're looking for KG. Scott Schnars in the chat. There we go. Scott hey. Schnars is in the chat. We got a third Schnars in the room. Not really in the room. Wait, oh. we already have like 10 schnars in the room. Oh, I see, now, oh, Ivan's, Ivan's made some adjustments to his units, so okay. he's going to show. But let's see if that's a... Uh, wow, that was a... Uh, Victor K comes in 17.55, and that is correct! Oh. Oh. Wow, that's not Victor. This one's Victor. That oh. is correct! Oh, I wow. wonder... Wow, 17.55 is correct. Mm. And... Now I give wonder... a proper shout out to Scott Schnars in the chat. Hi, Scott. Thanks for joining us. Hi. That was a typo from Ivan. Wow. He hit the zero instead of the dot, I think. Oh, no. Oh, dang. Oh, no. Ivan hit the zero instead of the dot on that answer. Oh, wow. No. Wow. wow. <laughs> wow. Well, we Copy have a, and... chant, oh. a chant from the crowd of copy and paste. Oh. Wow. Mm. Dang, that is painful. Well, it's a little known fact that keyboards wow. in Canada only have a period in like one part of the keyboard. So that's, it has a lot to do with it. So. Canadian keyboard. Canadian wow. keyboard. Hey, okay. the, man, there's, that the was so intense. Oh, wow. Oh, that was rough. So Victor K oh, comes in 17.46. Ivan types in 17 dot, but it ends up being zero, five, yeah. five, five. Oh, wow. Man.